Good morning. How's everybody? Happy October. New month, guys. Wow. Did September fly by for you guys? I think it flew by for me. Woo! The sun is shining. I was just going to debate whether or not I should wear this jacket or not because I'm actually, it's actually really beautiful outside. I don't know about where you live, but it has been absolutely crazy, the weather in Toronto. Last week, it was so hot. It was so hot in our classroom, we could barely breathe. And then it got so cold. <laughs> My husband has a cold. So many people are sick. Uh, that's what happens when this crazy weather changes but i heard it's gonna get hot again oh my god it's so bright so sunny actually it's a little cooler in the shade in the sun it's beautiful out so how are you guys doing i miss you um i hope you're doing well um i hope uh those that were celebrating yesterday had an easy fast happy healthy and a sweet new year uh, good good health to everybody um, anybody yeah so oh, oh my hair anyways uh, I'm just uh, gonna go for a walk and uh, have my water and I bring a fruit with me and then I'll have a good breakfast after I'm trying to figure out what to meal plan today um, I want to make my cauliflower soup again. I love having soup, especially at lunchtime these days. Uh, it just fills me up so much more. And having extra veggies, it's a great way to get in your veggies. You can sneak anything into a soup. And if you puree it, uh, it just makes it nice and thick. So that's my little tip. And... Uh, I have portobello mushrooms and I was thinking of making um, some kind of uh, stuffed mushroom, uh, maybe like a lasagna mushroom or something because I've done a pizza one so I want to try something else out and I haven't made quinoa in a while and I was thinking of making some quinoa too. We'll see and then of course I'll post it for you guys. So anyways I just wanted to just touch base tell you that I'm thinking about you Woo! I can't even see you there we go I'll walk backwards actually that's a good tip guys walk backwards it's really good for other areas of your legs and uh, yeah so uh, do that try that it's interesting although people think I'm crazy talking to my phone and walking backwards Oh, I am a little crazy. So new month, new plans, new goals, new exercises, new recipes, new foods, and most of all, new you to get to where you are. Um, I know people are asking how to stay motivated. Basically, you take one day at a time, okay? One step at a time, it's a journey. There's no magic pill. There's no time limit. You just have to remember that you just have to try to stay focused, track, plan, have the right things in the house. And uh, if you want something, you have a little bit of something, not a lot of something. And if you go off, then you get right back on track the very next morning or the very next meal is even better because some people like me in the past would say oh well you know what I didn't do well today so and you know I have this to go to and that to go to and we make we make up excuses to suit ourselves and then we feel guilty then we feel horrible about ourselves but when we're in control our, our uh, self-esteem rises, we feel so much better, we feel happier, we feel proud, and and that's what happens. Oh, we've got a lot of We're walkers here. behind me. Yeah, so I have a lot of people behind me. I have a Facebook group of over 17,000 people. 
<laughs> so you're saying hi to 17,000 people. <laughs> Anyways, so that's what you do. See, there's these lovely folks outside walking and jogging. And uh, anyways, again, you just take one day at a time, one moment at a time, and set small realistic goals. And when you achieve them, that's when you start to feel really good about yourself and really proud and determined. So that's another tip for you to do, okay? Set small, realistic, attainable goals, okay? So let me know how you're all doing and happy October, happy meal planning, happy tracking and uh, love you guys. Talk to you soon.